All right, this morning, some of the world's best surfers are eyeing the waves from beaches of Hawaii. They're competing in the first day of the World Surf League Championship Tour. It's the Billabong Pro Pipeline. Joining us live from the North Shore of Oahu is Vice President of Tours for World Surf League, Jesse Miley Dyer. Good morning to you. Thanks for being here. Good to see you again. Morning. How are you guys? We're great. So let's talk about the championship tour. What are we going to see? Yeah, I mean, right now we've got the men in the water, but this is a really big year for us. It's the first year that we have a fully combined men's and women's championship tour. So uh, WSL is pretty stoked, and it's going to be it's an awesome, awesome event already. Uh, Jesse, it is firing out there, as we as we like to say in, in, in surf lingo. We were uh, live, I think, when Owen Wright got a double barrel. So the conditions that the surfers are going to be in today, I mean, it, it doesn't get more heavy. It doesn't get any better, right? It is absolutely firing. You're totally right. Um, Owen, obviously, he loves it out here, but it is so beautiful right now. It's probably 15 to almost 20 feet faces, like really, really solid waves. And Today's the first day of our waiting period. We're going to have a really long day. Um, two rounds of the men will be on for today. So will you talk about the fact that you said that their women surfers will tackle the same pipelines as the men. Are they going to get equal pay as well? A lot of questions about that because things are changing in the sport. Yeah, we have equal prize money. Um, we've had it since 2019, and it's a really cool thing for us. Um, awesome for surfing to, to to be in that space with uh, you know not a lot of sports right now that have men's and women's equal prize money. So it's a big one, and to be here at Pipeline and to have equal pay for men and women is a is a really big deal for the WSL. So who are the top three women that we should be keeping our eyes on? Look, I think um, the top three women, it's Tyler Wright from Australia, Carissa Moore, our reigning world champion, um, and then also Moana jones Wong. She's our wild card here. She's a local specialist, and, you know, she's a really, really dangerous one. I'm going to say those, those three women are the top to beat. Is that the 17-year-old who's surfing better than most men are? No, Moana is, um, she's a local. She's a local Hawaiian here, and she's really, like, dedicated her life to to surfing pipeline and it was only right you know and, and super fitting that we would have her here for the first ever women's championship tour event at pipe wow that that really is historic when you really think about that let's talk about you mentioned her carissa moore a lot of people feel like she's unbeatable um uh, but you just you know that's pretty hard to that's not always true right anything can happen and it depends on the waves yeah for sure i mean like carissa is our very, very top of the sport as well. Obviously, she's our reigning world champ. She's also the Olympic gold medalist. Um, everyone's beatable, though. You know, I know that sounds really cliched in sports, but uh, she's got a really tough time. She's going to be up against Moana Jones Wong, and that's probably going to be the matchup of the round for us, for the women. All right, let's talk about the reality. I, I wrote this question myself because okay. there are these two girls. They're not on the tour just yet, but one of them, uh, I think she lives in San Diego County, Sierra Kerr, and the other one is Erin Brooks. Are the girls on tour right now really worried about those two when they qualify? Because I think, I think Sierra Kerr is probably the best woman surfer in the world, and she's not even on tour yet. How old is she? I think she's 14 or 15. Wow. Look, I think that everyone's definitely worried about them for sure. <laughs> There's so many young, um, up-and-coming women come, like, starting to come through the ranks. And you can see, like for us at WSL, you can see the, um, the investment in the women's tour and the focus and you, and that brings talent. So Sierra... Sarah and Erin Brooks, um, they're really, really good, like crazy, scary good. So I'm really excited for them to be on tour one day. They're, they're just starting to compete, but it's only a matter of time. <laughs> well, I mean, the surfers may be looking over their shoulders at these, up, you know, these coming, you know, up and coming surfers, but it just brings such excitement to the sport to know that, that you know, things are accelerating the way they are and elevating like that. I just think that's super fun. Yeah, I think so too. I mean, one of the things that both Sierra and Erin are really, really good at is all the aerials, the really progressive maneuvers. Uh -huh. And that, I mean, that's like the next, the next generation of, of young women coming through that are just doing these crazy, crazy tricks. And um, I'm so, it's so really exciting for us. And, and you know, it's going to be awesome to have them there. I mean, I can say that because I'm not on tour competing, but everyone's <laughs> definitely looking over their shoulder. Yeah. She's sitting nice and comfortable. Yeah, yeah you're comfy. She's you're all right, so really quickly, yeah, totally. let, let, let's do our predictions. Who, who do we okay. think is going to win Pipeline? We'll, we'll have you go first, Lynette, and then me. Oh, we got you there? Did we lose you? Oh, she's pretending she can't Me? hear. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Jesse, I'm, I'm trying to get your prediction. Like, uh, who, who do you, you think is going to win? Um, 
You know what? Honestly, I think that this the, we have the first round heat that's Moana Jones Wong and Chris and Moore. I think whoever wins that heat could take out the whole event. That's my prediction. I'm with you. I'm going with Carissa. <laughs> I'm going with Carissa Moore. It's just, I think it's the safest bet. That's so much fun. Thank you so much for talking with us. We love just being able to go to Oahu with you. Uh, you can watch the World Surf League's Billabong Pro Pipeline at worldsurfleague.com or also on YouTube. And we're so glad to bring it to you live here where we saw some great stuff. That's right. Just happened to be live at the right time. We'll be right back.